Dr. Laura Sennett here, audiologist and audio engineer with Tuned. I'm going to show you how to use Live Listen, a remote microphone built into your iPhone. It might help you hear better in restaurants or any loud environment. This is what it sounds like without using Live Listen as a remote microphone. This is what it sounds like with Live Listen. All right, I've turned on Live Listen now. So my iPod is picking up my voice and sending it. Live Listen uses the iPhone microphone to send sound directly to your hearing aids, AirPods, or any made for iPhone hearing device. If the iPhone is close enough to the person's mouth, you'll hear their voice above or louder than the background noise. Here are the steps. First, set up a hearing shortcut on your control center. Next, connect your AirPods or any MFI enabled earphone to your device. Then open the hearing shortcut and tap on Live Listen to enable it. You'll see the audio meter move when you talk. All right, I've turned on Live Listen now. So my iPod is picking up my voice and sending it straight to my AirPods Pro. Would you mind Hand the device to the person you want to hear better and briefly explain that it'll pick up their voice and send it to your earphones so you can hear them better. Ask them to either put the device on the table in front of them or in their breast pocket if that pocket is shallow enough. Tip, turn off transparency mode, otherwise you might hear a delay or echo because you'll hear both the ambient sound from transparency mode and the live listen sound. This is what it sounds like with transparency mode and live listen both on. It's one of my favorite foods, and wahoo happens to be my favorite fish. I've only eaten wahoo once, and I ate it at 3 a.m. And this is what it sounds like with only live listen audio. Before getting on a flight out of Panama, I cooked it in a toaster oven, and it was one of the best meals of my life. And this is what it might sound like if you didn't have live listen at all. You want me to put it in my pocket or just put it down? Uh, uh, does that work? A bowl? I don't think it doesn't bowl. work. Okay, so don't put it in a bowl. It's not perfect. You may find yourself toggling transparency mode on and off or needing to ask people to pass the device around. You also might not feel comfortable handing your iPhone to anybody. iPods and iPads also work, however. Typically, though, the most difficult part is simply feeling comfortable enough to ask someone to use it. I promise you, it becomes easier and easier the more you do it. Try it first with people you're really comfortable with. And if you need more assistance, remember to always ask your employer if you have hearing health benefits with Tuned. Okay, thank you.